Ah, oh, thank you, Goop. Thank you for waking me up. I get so sleepy every time. How's it going, everybody? Jubu, it's very good to see you. It's been a while. I didn't realize you were a streamer. I clicked on your, but I saw that you had an emote that had your name, and so I clicked on your your name, and sure enough, you were a streamer, and so I gave you a follow. You have a very cute avatar. I'm going to uh, check out one of your VODs later. So, yeah. I don't know if he mentioned that before. I'm sorry if I miss it. How's it going? Uh, tonight we're going to be doing some 3D modeling. Oh, and another thing, uh, Jubu, uh, you gave your slime an evolution fruit. I added a new thing where um, slimes will grow in size a little bit when you feed them a fruit. So they can get to like one and a half times normal size. So, yeah, it's a new feature, so it's a little little janky, but hopefully it adds a little bit of visual feedback when you feed the slime so you don't have to like feed them ten times before something changes so so yeah the thing we are 3d modeling is a character from a streamer named Benicula that I am very fond of the character's name is Shmoo they're this little little paper bag ghost little guy and I'm making like a 3d model of them um I don't have a whole lot to go off of because it's based on a sprite from a uh, uh, Castlevania game. So th this is pretty much the only reference material I have. So it is going to be up to artist interpretation a little bit. Hi. Oh, Cabby! <laughs> Cabby, thank you so much for resubscribing. Goodness. We love seeing Padlock, and we love seeing you here. How's it, how's it going, Cappy? Where's my hand? Double waves. Uh, why is the image blurred? Why are you making something not so sick? No, it's... Okay, so what I'm doing is I'm making an eyeball um, for this character that we're 3D modeling, and the only reference we have is this tiny-ass PNG sprite sheet. So, like, <laughs> this is what I copy and pasted. That's what they all say. They all say that. They all say they're um, making a 3D model of a uh, pixel art character. <laughs> Every single person says that. I, I That sounds dubious to me. How are you doing, Cappy? So I'm going to do my darndest to make it look somewhat like it does here. So far, we've got this. We've got like a little wiggly boy, and I did some animations for him too, although you can't see animations in uh, Substance Painter. Doing good? Was that the Five Nights at Fred- uh, oh, might watch Five Nights at Freddy's later? There is a Five Nights at Freddy's movie, isn't there? I'm surprised it took as long as it did to come out. I heard Matt Pat's in it, which I guess is appropriate. So we are going to model or draw some eyeballs that we'll just sort of put on there as like 2D cards. Make it a little bit oblong. We'll fill it with that orangey color. Okay, so there's that. Then we need to give it an outline. We'll make that a darker purple. Oh, it doesn't update in real time. It would be nice if it did. There we go.
Yeah, I um I follow game theory on YouTube because there's one of the people on there that I like named Austin that does more like um what if you did this physics thing in a video game and it were that way in real life, which is the stuff that Matt Pat used to do before he became mm-hmm. like the FNAF theory guy. Kevin Steel Pants, hello. How's it do- how's it going? Um yeah, so I I, I don't watch the Matt Pat videos, but I do see the uh clickbaity thumbnails. Um, like the, we need to talk, we need to talk ones. Um, and one of them is like, yeah, I'm in the FNAF movie. So, yeah. I don't have a lot of animosity for the guy. I just, I don't like him very much. He, he's, he's, um, appealing to an audience that is not me. So that's, it's fair. Uh, we are going to hold a little bit of a slime race after I do this last little eye highlight here. Tiny hat. Look at my teeny tiny hat. You can barely see it. How are you doing, Kevin Steel Pants? Oh, yeah, Cappy, those are the ones I'm talking about. Yeah, the Austin, um, like, the science of the insert thing here. Yeah, and I, I do like his, like, Google Doc, um, oh, I forget which, um, classical music guy he uses. Is it Vivaldi? I'll say it's Vivaldi. It's probably not. Okay, so there's an eyeball. Okay, so we will save this. And let's have ourselves a little slime race, why don't we? Because we got some cool folks in here. Let me turn off the JBs for a minute, and we'll head over to Slime Race Island. I think that might have been a little early. Oh, well, I heard an ahoy. Oh, yeah, there he is. There, Sir Pants. The boy, the myth, the legend. The D20. Beppo, hello! How's it, how's it going? Grandmaster B, I forgot that's what you named your little one. Very cute. We got Feisty Mecha Breeder on the field. There's that little Riku emote. I like that one, it's cute. Alright, we have three seasoned champions of the racetrack on the field. I will give a D20 Mega Super Cheer. <laughs> Let's see if he can roll some Nat 20s. On your, uh, hmm, what would it be? I guess it would be an athletics check, because I think athletics is usually running super fast. Um, I, I suppose an acrobatics check would also be in order for dodging the, uh, geysers. Uh, I'll do a 10 count, uh, because I know Jubu is here. Uh, I want to give anybody that might be lurking a chance to join if they'd like to. So we will start in 10, 9, 8, 7, Six. Hey, Captain Steel Pants, I'm the one that does the counting around here. No. <laughs> this is this is my ship. I know you're you're not the captain of every stream. You are definitely the captain of most streams, to be fair. Okay, so just to spite you, I'm gonna start from six. Five, four, three, two, th- let's just start. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> All right, you forced me to use T for Teen language. All right, we are off to the races, the first wacky race of the evening. Grandmaster B starting off being a sleepy little bean, falling back a little bit as we go over the summit of Bunny Hill. Sir Pants is taking a narrow early lead. Oh, but Feisty Mecha Breeder is giving them a run for their money. Beppa, thank you for 32 bits. Thank you. I didn't. I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't sure if your slime pooped out the coins or not. I, th- I think they should have been. I was watching this 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 death match between Feisty and uh, yeah. There you go. There's the there's the coin poops. Thank you for for cheering. All right, Sir Pants maintaining their narrow lead. 
as we go across the Nickelodeon the fuck out waterfall bridge. These little ones are making their way across this aggro crag. Who will take home a piece of the aggro crag? No one, because that's not a prize that I award for this thing. <laughs> you will not go home with a polygon from Slimer Island. I'm sorry, I don't have the technology for that yet. <laughs> Alright, Sir Pants taking a little nap in front of their geyser. A bold strategy, let's see if it pays off. Oh, they get pushed back a little bit. You hate to see it. Oh, Feisty Mecha Breeder getting pushed back. Alright, both of these little beans are past their geysers. Grandmaster B is a little far behind, but stranger things have happened. Bigger upsets have happened. Feisty Mecha Breeder pulling ahead by quite a bit. It's gonna take some, some magic fairy dust from RNGesus to s swing that around. And it looks like RNG Jesus was asleep at the wheel. Feisty Mecha Breeder is our first winner for the first slime race of the evening, followed by Sir Pants. Grandmaster B coming up. Coming across that finish line. There are three boys on the field, or three beans on the field, excuse me, so everybody will be getting a prize, but Feisty Mecha Breeder will be getting an extra special one. Let's go to Slime Race Results Island to see y'all got in the city that's a dumb song <laughs> all right congratulations to cappy and the little one feisty mecha breeder they're gonna want a gold feather in the cap that well it doesn't really have a cap but a bomb wick grandmaster b learns a little yoshi's island song on the fisher price piano sir pants learns the chrono trigger opening theme feisty will win an extra special prize Oh, a little stone spell. Look out now. We got a little Earthbender bomb boy. Congratulations to all of you. Very fine race. From some very fine, fine slimes. How's it going, Beppo? I didn't get to wave to you before. Um, we have a couple of people that followed us um, off air, so I am going to... Let's see, I'm going to replay some of those alerts. Uh, Tay Liddy, thank you for following. I think you were on Dead Sun stream, I remember you. Uh, as well as um, Oximus Prime, I think is how you read this. Thank you very much for following, I appreciate it. I hope I can catch you on air. Mowgli, hello! How's it going? It's good to see you. Thank you for dropping in. You just missed a slime race, but we're going to do another one later. Uh, we're going to uh, head back to doing some 3D modeling of this character. Uh, from Benicula, the little schmoo guy. This is the sole reference that we have for this little bean, so... Um, I did the 3D model and some animations for it, and now we're doing the texturing, so... So we are making an eyeball. So there's eyeball one, we did that. And then we're going to do a second one. He's got kind of asymmetrical eyes, so this one's going to be a little derpier. Got some Sharon Jones on the radio. I never got a chance to see Sharon Jones live. I, I slept on it, and then she... Passed away like a week after the concert I skipped, which was upsetting. <laughs> so the eye is about. Hmm. How long am I planning on streaming for? Um. Hmm. I usually stream for about two to three hours. It's usually closer to two hours. Echo Flasty, hello! Very good to see you! My, oh my god, I wish my left hand were a little more responsive, because I like doing double waves, and I also like doing the, 
um, Simpsons season. Uh, well, I guess uh, any season that David Silverman worked on, he always had characters doing the the fingies. And oh man, it's because my phone is in front of my face for the facial capture, so sometimes the left hand. But yeah, Simpsons characters will always go like, ooh. Yeah. Anyway, and then season one also had the twisty mouths. Like, mm, mm, mm. yeah. So. Oh, look, title copier has a. OK, yeah, we got a spam bot in there. The dumb thing is that I think spam bots do get slimes. So. Welcome, uh, title copier. If you want to change the color of your slime, you can go into the redeems. <laughs> OK, I'm going to ban this person. What? I'm going to copy their. Username, I hate to punish a slime for the actions of their. Guardian, but we're gonna go ahead and delete that. Uh, yeah, I'm making some notes here. Okay, I'll have to remember to delete those slimes later from the archive. Okay, back to the avatar view. Oh, yeah, let me see. I gotta ban this person, too. Uh, how do I ban them? Uh... I... Let me make sure I... copy their name correctly. Cappy3232 ban... No, I'm kidding. Um... There we go. All gone. Yeah, um, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I'm not sure if I have somebody, um, that is, like, here regular enough to be a mod, um, and then also, like, I stream at weird times, so, I don't know. I feel like a mod is for someone that has, um, gotten a bit more notoriety. I'm still kind of a small time streamer. But maybe I have to think big, you know? Uh, if you're using Twitch, you can drag their message to the side, can't you? Um, yeah, I what I'm using to manage the stream is uh, Streamlabs, so I'm using their desktop app. Um, and I'm sure it has some, like, drag-and-drop stuff in it, but, you know. I can't be bothered. Uh, did you want to join Thick? Um... Oh, sorry, hello! Uh, do you want to join, uh, Think and I watching Five Nights tonight? Um, were you gonna watch it on, like, a streaming service or something? Oh, we got a- we got a raid! Oh my goodness! <laughs> to the stream. Welcome, we- oh. I got- I got late starting the raid song. But yeah, I usually do a little song. <laughs> so many things are happening at once. Hello, Saria! I'm gonna turn the funk back on. There you go. Yeah, sorry. Thank you so much for raiding. It, it's, it's been a while. Uh, yeah, very good to see you. Uh, for anybody new here, uh, I'm Fruitsy Collins. I am a VTuber, uh, 3D modeler, and Unreal Engine developer. Uh, we have a 3D interactive environment here that's running in a real-time game engine. Um, if you are new here and you chat for the first time, we've got a little virtual pet system. Uh, how am I? Sorry, I'm doing very well. Um, if anybody's new here, if you type in chat, you get one of these little beans. And if you check in the channel redeems, there's all kinds of stuff you can do to interact with them. Like, you can give them pats on the head. Like, I'm gonna pet my little boy Goop here. Oh, thank you for the follow! I gotta pat my little ghost boy Goop. And yeah, so you can dress them up and you can, um, evolve them with fruits and stuff. All kinds of fun things. Let me shout out Saria. Let's see. 020 S A R I A. Yeah, go ahead and uh, check out Saria's streams. Uh, Saria is a big friend of the show. Uh, mature audiences, but um, uh, but Saria is uh, another Blender uh, 3D modeler, very talented one, and another Unreal Engine developer doing some really cool stuff. So, yeah, definitely check out their streams. Uh, uh, it is, uh, mature content. 
So yeah, you have been warned. But but very good content. Oh yeah, and uh, s uh let's see. Uh, Superil Sucko, uh, sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name, but thank you for following. Replaying that alert for you. Let me see if I missed any chat as I was doing my spiel. A mega chad has five sturdy fruit. Well on your way to becoming a square slime. We are doing some 3D modeling tonight. A uh, fellow uh, VTuber, uh, Benicula Alive, has a character named Shmoo. This is cute little little paper bag ghost boy. Um, and I'm doing a 3D model of them. We've got, uh, let's see, we've got this going on so far. So uh, right now I'm modeling like the eyes and mouth and stuff. So we're going to stick them on there. Keeping it pretty low poly. So how did, how did your stream go, Saria? What were you doing? Were you doing some more, like, character modeling? Or, like, some guns or something? I haven't popped in one of your streams in a while. I gotta fix that. Really well, I'm glad to hear it. And since so many... Oh, I've been low polyed. Aw, oh, beans. <laughs> all my polygons is gone. Oh, all my, my lumens and my nanites are all gone, and I still have these weird dots underneath my chin. I don't know what's going on with that texture, but for some reason, goth mode, low poly, um, has those. So, yeah. Ah, heck. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, doing a stream next month is one of my other characters. I made blend shapes for... Very cool! Is it a character that, um... I guess this will be a hard question for you to ask, but is it a character I've seen before? That's kind of an abstract question. But I guess, is it, is it one that you've, like, modeled on the stream before? The shark? Oh, the shark! Yes, I remember the shark one. But yeah, since we have so many new people in here, I would like to show off one of the, uh, one of the more, like, back-of-the-box features we have for the stream, uh, called a slime race. Uh, there's little things that your slimes can learn how to do, uh, like cast magic spells. Like, my boy knows some spells. It's got a little dark spell there. But yeah, and you win those special abilities by uh, doing slime races. So we will go ahead and queue one of those up. Let's head on over to Slime Race Island. Which is looking extra spooky for Spooky Month. If you would like your little one to participate in a slime race, go ahead and type exclamation point play in the chat. And even if you don't have one spawned yet, it will make a new one for you. And that'll be your forever slime. All right, there's Saria's little one, Envy, little princess. There's Mowgli's little one. Oh, Oximus Prime! Very happy to see you. I gave you a little follower alert um, earlier because you followed me off of the stream uh, while Dead Sun was streaming. Um, if you want to see that, uh, that alert again, uh, let me know and I can play that for you after the slime race. Oh, Flowers and hello! It's been a while! Very good to see you. We've got one more spot available on the racetrack if anybody else would like to join. Redis Rabbit, hello! Oh man, so many cool people are dropping in. $10 games, uh, first time chat, welcome. Okay, so I am going to start a counter uh, from 10. And if we don't get that final spot filled up, I'll have my little boy Goop jump in. So I'll start 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right, Goop, come on in. <laughs> Bones, it's a very good name. Yeah, there's my little ghost boy. All right, let's get started with the race. Got a full house, very exciting. So if you're new here, the way these races work is that your little one has a random chance of falling asleep every once in a while. And if you type cheer into chat, uh, it will wake them up a little bit faster. And it's just like a text thing. You don't have to put exclamation point in front of it. I think it'll still work if you put exclamation point in front, but, um, it's it just uh, if it has those letters in it, it will it'll go ahead and work on its own. 
It's possible that putting an exclamation point will make it not read as a chat message. I, I'm not quite sure about that. I haven't tested it. But yeah, anything with those letters in it will work. So if you get a repeat message thing, that's, uh, that's a way to get around it. Alright. Boy, things are pretty close between Nickelodeon, uh, NV it looks like, and... So... Super Olsuko? I am having a hard time pronouncing that name. Please let me know after the race how I should say your name, because I I think most streamers have an inability to pronounce people's usernames while they're streaming. Because streamer brain is a real thing. Alright, Nickelodeon has a very narrow lead as we move on to the last section of Slime Race Island, the treacherous Geyser Valley. These little thermal vents can push your little one back a few centimeters, sort of mix things up at the end of the race. Oh boy, I gotta be... My boy has been falling asleep a lot, I gotta pay more attention to him. Oh, Nickelodeon, getting pushed back. Oh, this might be a photo finish. All these little beans trying their very best. The first three people to finish will get prizes. And first place will get an extra special prize. Oh, who's it gonna be? Is it gonna be Super or Nickelodeon? Oh, looks like it was Super! Congratulations on winning your first slime race. Very solid performance. I wish I could say the same for my boy Goop. He is getting stunlocked by the <laughs> by the geysers. <laughs> Nitro slime, absolutely. Alright. Mowgli's little one, Mega Chad, living up to their name, coming in third place. Come on, Goop. $10 games and Bones coming across the finish line, and V taking a little bit of a nap. Somebody put a pee under uh, under this little princess's uh, mattress to, to wake her up. Oh, that's a dumb joke. I don't even think that's what the pee did in that story. I have no idea. Alright, Goop drags his ass across the finish line, dead last, always a disappointment. Let's go to Race Results Island and see what these little beans won. Very good performance out of all of you, except for Goop. Alright, congratulations to Super's little one. You're gonna get a gold feather in your cap. Mega Chad, win a little Yoshi's Island song on the Fisher Price piano. Nickelodeon will learn a little drum song, and Super will win an extra special prize. Oh, they learned how to draw Sonic the Hedgehog! Yeah, that's one of the things slimes can do. They can draw pictures on my floors. <laughs> Nickel Nickelodeon falling asleep at the end, yeah. From evolving into Nick at Night, I suppose. Or maybe Snick, since it's Saturday. <laughs> Congratulations to everybody. Thank you for participating. That was fun. Let me see if I missed anything in chat. Lots of cheers. Cheers is cheers. <laughs> Sorry, I was thinking pretty upset with, with her little one. Envy did a had a very solid performance. Uh Super El Succo. Okay, there we go. That that I will. Cool. I, w I will do my best to remember that. I am notoriously bad at uh, memorizing uh, usernames, but I will do my best. Oh, and $10... Oh, wait. Uh, yeah. Super El Succo, you follow the channel, so I'm going to replay your alert. There you go. Thank you very much for following. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I... I would probably take that up with RNGs, it's not with your little one. They're all trying their best. But yeah, RNGs can be a real, a real B-word sometimes. Oh, thank you for the head pets! Uh, Oximus? Is, is that how I should say your name? She's gonna get it later. Um, Envy, I would like to, uh, just remind you that the baby jail, uh, is a safe place. Friendship. Friendship? <laughs> Boom! <laughs> fellow friend of the... I keep saying fellow friend of the show, that makes absolutely no sense. But hello, Boom, how's it going? 
I'm going to go ahead and give you a shout out. It is always quite the chore copying and pasting your name. But yeah, we're going to we're going to do it. We're going to go that extra mile. Shout out, boom. <laughs> Boom is a very good streamer and has some of the best emotes in the biz, I, um, I think. So, yeah. Um, Boom is another Unreal Engine developer and uh, Blender modeler. Uh, very, very talented. Oh, thank you for following. Uh, was that $10 games? Six spooky fruit. Yeah, there's your alert again. Since it got kind of cut off there. Yeah, thank you so dang much for following $10 Games. Hi, Boom, how's it going? I saw you were streaming earlier. I didn't, I didn't get to catch it. Uh-oh. Speaking of Boom. <laughs> yes, that is a good example of Boom's 3D modeling. Yeah, that's the bag, man. That's sort of a, um, that was a test model that, uh, Boom made for, um, for just testing some bullshit, and, um, it's become kind of a running joke amongst Hi. some other VTubers. <laughs> okay, I'll call you, I'll call you ten. I'll do my best to remember that. Keep in mind, I have streamer brain. Let's see, we will use the warp tool on this to make it kind of weird shaped. Yeah, I think that should work. Yeah, that should be good for that. Ooh, we got some forget-me-nots on the radio. <laughs> you speed ran it. <laughs> VTuber modeling any percent. No gl no glitches. Oh, Sherber, that's a cute name, Ten. I like that. Oh, eight big fruit. Oh, you're gonna be a long slime pretty soon if you keep that up. Let's see, we'll do a little warp on this one. Make it look a little less... Computer generated, a little more organic. Okay, that should be good. God, this is a good song. Okay. Oh, in Photoshop, you used to be able to save as a PNG, but now you got to do save as a copy. I don't know why they step backwards. Adobe's getting worse by the minute. And yes, I know there are free alternatives, but I'm lazy. Let's see, where am I saving these things? Forget me nuts. <laughs> Pet your little one. <laughs> There's our little ghost uh, resident. Uh, uh, I'm calling him Whisper. Um, I don't know. Whisper doesn't like talk or anything, but they're sort of just hating the place. I just needed to call them something, so. Until Whisper corrects me on their name and their pronouns, I'm just going to say they and Whisper. I don't know if they're even aware of, of my presence. They're just sort of phasing in and out of our dimension. Okay, so there's one I card here. Save for web does PNG. Yeah, save as a copy also does the. I think they added that as an extra step because of Apple somehow. Like they they had to, like iOS had an update that made it so that save as just doesn't can't save as a different file type. I don't know. Oh, stretch break. Thank you. Yeah, I will. I will go ahead and do that. Thank you very much, Ten. 
Oh, Flower Sen says uh, Boom streams have a lot of lights. Yeah, I know, I know Boom's been doing some uh, uh, video game uh, development. Um, yeah, there's lots of like quick moving things. Um, so yeah, that can be a little overwhelming for some people. Uh, boom streams are very fun, but can be pretty intense, uh, which which I think is is very fun. Lots of memes and redeems and such. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go on that stretch break. Thank you very much. Uh, we'll go to the slime cam while I do that. I will hydrate as well. Oh, look at Rabbit's little bunny slime. <laughs> they just recently evolved. Okay, BRB. Oh my goodness, we're getting a raid. <laughs> we, oh, I missed the Oh, we missed the raid graphic cuz I was I was away. Uh who raided us? Uh Crafty Kiki Apocalypse. Thank you very much for raiding us. We re I really appreciate that. How's it going? How was how did your stream go? Um my camera got a little off center. Okay, yeah, now I'm looking at the screen. Yeah, thank you so much for raiding and bringing your crew in. Make sure you take care of yourself. Uh let me know how how your stream went. What you were up to? Welcome, readers, indeed. Yeah, if you're new to the channel, looks like some of you figured it out already. Uh, we've got a little virtual pet system over there. Uh, over there, my camera is reversed. Yeah, we got the, the this little chow garden going on over there. Uh, you, you get a little slime that you can customize and, um, you know, dress in little hats and uh, uh, evolve and give head pats to. Like, I'm going to give my boy Goop a head pat because he, he, he deserves it. Oh, I chose the wrong redeem. Well, he's going to cast a spell now. There we go. Oh, Allocate, hello. Good to see you. It's been a while. Very good to see you allocate. Yeah, we're doing a little 3D modeling here. I am making some eyeballs for this character. And thank you for playing the Lavos theme. It always freaks me the fuck out. Uh, maybe not as much as Kefka's theme. We have that, too. Okay, so we made our eyeballs. Hello, Mercedes Veb, and hello, Halo. Thank you for drawing on my carpet. <laughs> oh, it is, it is nice to see people interacting with this, um, this system that I, um, worked tirelessly on. I was, I was gonna say, um, the system that I worked very hard on, but, uh, I don't like saying hard on. It sounds T for teen. So I always try to come up with an alternate way of saying it. Because there's a running gag here that I'm, like, super wholesome, even though I'm definitely not. Okay, so we are going to go back into Substance Painter. And we're going to import the dim eyeballs. Let's see, they will be textures. Um, I'm gonna import resources. Okay, I card one and two. Uh, that'll be a texture. That'll be a texture. Import. There we go. Oh, thank you for watering, Mandy. <laughs> 
Yeah, Mandy is her little office mandragora. Um, if you water her enough time, she'll grow a little little fruit on her head. And the fruit that grows is random, so even I don't know what it is what it's gonna be. <laughs> okay, here's here is our boy's face. Um where is the front of our boy? Gotta go to dinner, time to lurk. Yeah. Thank you, thank you very much for bringing your cur Oh, thank you for following, Crafty. Yeah, and thank you so much for bringing your crew in. I uh, hope, I hope I see you again. I hope you have a good dinner. V very much appreciate you and your crew. Have a good night. Oh, G fuel. I don't know if that's something Mandy should be drinking. Yeah, thank you so much. Look at you thanking me. That's my job. Okay, so we need to make dim eyeballs a little larger. Can I scale them both at the same time? I guess not. <laughs> oh, Flower said, I, well... I'm not wholesome. I do kind of. Why is my camera keep going off center? I need to. I need to. Yeah, there needs to be an illusion that I'm looking at you when I look at my second monitor. I think what is hurting that effect is that I don't have my ring light on. I should be turning that on. There we go. So my phone should be able to see my face a little better. Um. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not wholesome. I kind of swear like a sailor, but uh, you know. I don't do like a lot of horny content or anything like that. No, like not a lot of violent content. Um, so yeah, like adult language is fine here. Um, yeah, no, just don't, don't be hateful. Don't be gross. Yeah. This is common sense. But yeah, I, I'm, mm, I guess I'm wholesome in some ways, but, um, T for teen and others. Oh, allocate. Yeah, thank you very much. Okay, let's take a look at our reference to see how big we should make them eyes. Oh, I wish I could have that in front at the same time. Let's see here. Let's see, I need to have these both open at the same time. Does my camera move automatically? Um, sort of. Uh, some of the, um, some of the redeems, um, move the camera automatically, like if I did, um, like if I pet my boy on the head. Oh. I keep using the wrong redeem. Uh, but let's have him draw something. Um. Yeah, when you do a slime redeem, it will go over to that slime. It has a camera attached to them. Um, and then I have some, I have a stream deck on my desk here that I can use to move the camera to some places. Like we can go over to the friend shelf there. So yeah, and then I can switch between um, um, kind of a close up view and a like far view and then i also have a 3d or i have a, a green screen mode that i can go to that takes a camera to another spot so yeah mm. so yeah partially automated partially manual <laughs> oh fire spell look out now oh dark spell <laughs> yeah one issue that i have with the camera control is that um if two people do something at the same time, it can get a little bit fucky. Um, so I need to um, implement some kind of like event queue system so that doesn't happen so often. Bye. 
Oh, allocate. Uh, I think the reason yours didn't sing is because they don't know any songs yet. You know what? We can hold another slime race and um, you can get a chance to uh, win a little song for your little one. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, if you type in something that the slime doesn't know how to do, they'll randomly pick something that they do know how to do. And it looks like yours hasn't learned how to do anything yet, so they um, kind of didn't uh, respond to it. So sorry about that. The, the system is definitely not perfect. Oh, <laughs> speaking of not perfect. Oh, boy. There we go. <laughs> speaking of my camera system not being the best. Okay. Um, oh boy, it made the music stop. Well, let's see if this works. <laughs> Hold on, let me see if this works. Oh, I think I messed up. Hang on a second. <laughs> I pressed the wrong button on my stream deck. Let's see if it works now. There we go. It should be working now. <laughs> Sorry about that. A little bit of a hiccup. You'll have to type exclamation point play again for your little one to show up. <laughs> I have a button for um, starting the mini game, and then I have a button for starting the race. And I pressed the start race button first and messed things up. All right, we got two more spots available on the field for anybody that would like to participate in this year's slime race. For the opportunity to win a fabulous thing for them to be able to do. Beliza coming in hot. We got one more space available. Oh, it's, uh, Super coming in. Their little one, Rocky. <laughs> the the slimes are not especially fast. Oh, it looks like things have filled up. So yeah, sorry to to Thule. Might catch you next time. Let's go ahead and start the race. All right, we are off to the races yet again. Oh, and welcome to the stream, Tuli. Yeah, your slime didn't enter the race, but they should um, have spawned in the baby jail for when we go back um, after the mini game. So you'll be able to say hello to your slime afterwards. Alright, we are making our way down Bunny Hill. Halo is taking kind of a decisive lead this early on in the race. Halo is one of our season champions. They have won quite a few races. And my boy is being very sleepy back there. Alright, Halo falling asleep, giving Rocky a chance to close the distance as we cross over Waterfall Bridge, which has been turned green for Spooky Month. Oh, there are so many beans on the field, it is hard to tell who is who and what is what. Oh, thank you for following, Thule! Really appreciate it, thank you. Alright, Halo maintaining their lead, although it's not quite as decisive as it was, was before. As we move on to the final stretch of Slime Race Island, the treacherous Geyser Valley. Geyser Valley is R and Jesus' favorite part of Slime Race Island. They get the opportunity to fly in on their magic broom and and jostle the slimes around a bit to mix things up in the last third of the race. Oh, and my boy's being very sleepy. Alright, Halo has been dominating this race. Can anyone challenge Halo? Alright, Halo has come in first place, but there's two more spots available for winning prizes. Rocky's gonna get the second place prize. Looks like Mixie and Grandmaster B were competing for third. Grandmaster B will win a little song along with Rocky, and Halo will get an extra special prize. And <laughs> Nickelodeon getting falling asleep on a geyser. 
Halo getting a uh, very respectable two minutes and four seconds. I think Halo might hold second place on the leaderboard. I think Hawkeye still holds first place for the world record. <laughs> Double geyser, do you hate to see it? Alright, Nickelodeon. Coming on in. No slime left behind, that's what I say. Alright, let's go to Race Results Island. Oh, Tuli, I really appreciate that. Yeah, thank you for dropping in. I'll play uh, a little alert to celebrate you uh, following uh, when we finish this, uh, this award ceremony. Grandmaster B went on a little Link to the Past song. Nice little Yoshi's Island song. And Halo win an extra special prize. <laughs> Halo learned how to draw the little fox, from, or the little, uh, little dog from Undertale. Alright, let's turn the funk back on. Got some Sly in the Family Stone. Yeah, Tuli, thank you so much for following. Here's your little follower alert. Your little summon in circle. We really appreciate it. Oh, I'm glad you had fun, Allocate. You'll, you'll get them next time. I, 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 can, I, I can feel it. <laughs> Mixie eating some feisty fruit on their way to becoming a kitty slime. And yeah, anybody new to the channel, there's also a website uh, where I update um, information on your slimes. Um, if you go to the About section, um, there will be a link to the slime archive. Um, it has little uh, pages for each of your slimes with their stats and stuff. Um, I usually update like that like a day or two after the stream. Um, and there is also a section with a chart that shows off the different things that your slimes can evolve to. Um, uh, things that people have evolved into so far have been filled out. So you can, uh, if there's one that you like, you, you can um, kind of eat fruit to go toward that one. So, yeah. Yeah, there's still a few slime evolution forms that have not been um, achieved quite yet. But most of them have been unlocked. Let's see, we need the projection depth to be a lot larger on this one. There we go, okay. Oh, spooky fruit. <laughs> Making your way to being a skull slime. Yeah, my my boy Goop is a uh, um, spooky spooky. He 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 went through a second stage evolution to become a ghost slime by eating twenty spooky fruit. And every time you feed your slime an evolution fruit, they also increase in size a, a small amount. Oh, Tuli, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Uh, it looks like his, it looks like Schmooze. Oh, how did I flip this? There we go. Yeah, it looks like the seam on his head isn't quite centered. Let me see. Oops. Yeah, it looks like it's supposed to be not quite centered. <laughs> Sorry I haven't made too much progress um, on this art so far. Chat is much more active than I'm used to. I'm still kind of a small-time streamer. But it, it, it's definitely fun getting to know y'all. Oh. 
Good boy. Yeah. Yeah. I guess it's okay for now. Okay, so Shmoo has a little like slit for a mouth. Oh, someone cast on a little water spell. Oh, there we go. Oh, perfect. Let's see, what shape is his mouth? It's got kind of a lopsided smile. Yeah. Let's see, can we decrease the number of stitches? Sample cycle count. Mm, let's see. Oh, we got a little ad break. Now ad break is over. Let's see. This isn't giving me quite the effect that I um. was looking for. Oh, Rocky, I think you um, need to put... Um, um, Super L Saga, sorry, you need to put spaces in between that. Um, let me go ahead and type that for you in the correct format, and then I'll refund your points for you. Yeah, if you type it like that, that should work, and I'll go ahead and give you those points back, because that redeems a little expensive. Critter dashboard? Yeah, absolutely. Sorry, my programming is a little, um, it could be better, so. I really should revise that to uh, account for, um, you know, like typos and stuff. Let's see. Um, viewer rewards, channel points. I'll go to request quay. 
Okay, so that was slime color change. Oh, and it looked like... I'll go ahead and refund both of those. There we go. Yeah, so you should have those points back. A new soul arrives! Oh! <laughs> Super El Sako 80 and Captain Steel Pants had a kid slime named Captain... Captain Stucko. <laughs> Captain Sucko? Uh, there's a little extra letter in there, but that's a, that's a pretty... It's a pretty good name. <laughs> it just splits the names in half and shoves them together. Oh, we don't need that BRB anymore. Let's see if we can find them. Oh, looks like Saku had a a couple of kids. How surprising giving that name. I can't find them. I have this button that randomly shoves them around. I think it might have been that red one over there. Oh, water spell. Yeah, it is quite crowded over there. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, we're having trouble finding your little bean. I'm gonna have to make the baby jail bigger than that. Let's see, so this... Seam wasn't quite what I was hoping it would be. Let's see here. Oh, that's a very nice color. Very satisfying bluish green. Let's see, I am still fairly new to this program. I feel like I'm not doing this correctly. Stitches Roller. No, that is not the one we want. We want, um, Stitches... Hmm. Quite sure how to do this one. There we go. That is more along the lines of the ticket. Slice with... Whoa. Oh, that is making the stream chug. That was the wrong slider. <laughs> Let's see. There we go. That's more along the lines of what I wanted. Boy, lots of spells being cast over there. Stitch with double stitches false. There we go, that's getting closer to what we want. Oh wow, we are dropping a whole lot of frames in the
Okay, I think we are back. Okay, I think we are back. Yeah, there we go. Sorry about that, everybody. <laughs> yeah, um, my Unreal environment did not crash. Streamlabs did. Uh, Streamlabs is the pits. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, Substance Painter takes up quite a few resources. Thank you for sticking around. I appreciate it. Oh, you unlocked the little things. Yeah, we have a, a seasonal, like, exclusive item. So if you redeem um, the uh, October exclusive item, uh, you will be able to equip things for your little one. And uh, you will have um, permission to um, equip and unequip those if you do it once. So, yeah. That can only be unlocked in uh, October. And next month, I think we're going to do, for November, a little mushroom cap. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Flaris. I, I really appreciate that. Thank you. Because I, I know there's a lot of, a lot of, uh, a lot of competition as far as like entertaining streams goes. Um, so I, I really appreciate anybody sticking around um, to watch this weird internet puppet show, like, uh, like it says here. There we go. Where my, where's my hand tracking? Fruitsies weird internet puppet show. Uh, okay. Man, Lefty has some trouble with uh, the hand tracking. Let me see if I can improve that with my phone placement. Okay, that's a little better. And then, yes, I'm still looking at the stream. Cool. I have a phone in front of my face um, on a little swivel that um, does my, like, facial capture. And then I have a little thing on my desk that um, keeps track of what my hands are doing. It's a very complicated setup with a lot of wires. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it, Flowerson. Oh, thank you for watering Mandy. Yeah, luckily the stream, the um, Unreal environment itself did not crash, so we didn't lose any progress. Uh, all your slimes are, were, were still alive and kicking, so no worries about that. Yeah, there's an auto save every um, one minute or so, so in, if something crashes, um, your slimes will um, come back the way that they can, that uh, you left them, and that that. Um, is uh, that is the case between streams as well? I probably should have mentioned that that there's there's a save system. Oh, you drawn a little eggy on my floor. Look at all those Sanix on the floor. Oh, I've been oh, I've been low polyed. Odd ah, odd ah, dang ah beans. Let's see, I'm not making a lot of progress with this stitch mouth, so I'm gonna go ahead and do other parts of it. Oh! <laughs> Captain Steel Pants always come in to wreck, to wreck shit up. <laughs> there we go. A little Prince MIDI for you. Oh, the Big Lee! Hello! How's it going? 
Always happy to see you. I would wave to you, but um, I didn't bother doing hand tracking for this mode. Oh, look at all them emotes. <laughs> oh, I've been T posed. Ah, oh, beans. Yeah, all beans is a oh I've been <laughs> Yeah, all beans is something that like Griffin McElroy says a lot, and most of the things I say are things that Griffin McElroy has said. They influence my sense of humor quite a bit. So if you ever if you ever wondered why I said all beans or say the word boy a lot, that's that's why. Oh, the big Wii, that should be a uh, pot lid. Uh, let me go ahead. I will remember after the stream to refund your points. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that after the stream. So, yeah, you'll have to do, I think it is one word. Let me see. Let's see. Uh. Pot lid. It should be um like that. Bye. Yeah, it's two words. I I will. Re you will have those um points available to you later. Who is Griffin? Griffin um is um oh I've been Ronnie'd. Yeah, Griffin McElroy is this dude. He um has done a lot of like comedy videos for like polygon.com. Um he has a podcast with his brothers called My Brother, My Brother and Me. Um he does a Dungeons and Dragons live play podcast called The Adventure Zone. Um yeah, he and his brothers are just like um they're kind of like me in that they are Mm, wholesome in some ways, but raunchy in other ways. Um, and yeah, they just have a very like fun, positive sense of humor um, that I enjoy a lot. Um, yeah, they are somehow whole. They are somehow like wholesome, but not lame at the same time, which is a very hard balance um, to achieve. Because um, it's easy to be funny and be mean at the same time. It is hard to be positive and funny at the same time, so that's something I admire about them. <laughs> Bill Pepper, hello! How's it going? I can't wave to you because I don't have hand tracking in this mode, but yeah, I appreciate it. Yeah, Captain Steel Pants really piled on the redeems, so there's all kinds of crazy crap going on. How are you doing? Yeah, if you like 3D modeling and you want to see somebody do it way be uh, better and faster than I do, um, yeah, go ahead and give uh, Vel Pepper a follow. Yeah, Vel Pepper is definitely... Um, a benchmark of quality for me as far as um like 3d modeling goes oh yeah flowerson if you want to look up um uh, Gr uh griffin um i'm going to type uh the name of something here yeah um there is a youtube series called griffin's amiibo corner oh thank god i can breathe again um yeah, there's there's a YouTube series called Griffin's Amiibo Corner that is a very like uh quick and easy thing to get into um that I find very funny. So yeah, that's a good place to start. Yeah, of course, of course, uh, Vel Pepper. Oh, and if any of you are all new to the channel, hi, I'm Pumpkin Potion, your your black and white cartoon uh, VTuber, you know. It was a dumb. I I do that dumb bit every time. 
Usually the bit is like, hey, I'm Pumpkin Potion, uh, Waka Waka, or did I do that, or some, or, uh, <laughs> Chili Dogs, you know. I attribute some dumb pop culture, um, catchphrase to Pumpkin okay. Potion just as a dumb joke, and it's dumb. <laughs> yeah, Pumpkin Potion had, um, once, um, joked about um, people thinking that she was some kind of Bendy in the Ink Machine character because they're like, they were like 12 and don't. Oh, color. Oh, we're not in Kansas anymore. <laughs> Boom with the extra rows. Yeah, we gave Boom a shout out earlier, and sometimes that's a challenge because names are hyperlinks, and so it's hard to select that when it's multiple lines. Yeah, we have um we have boom on the the friend shelf over there and I needed to expand the name card on on hers a little bit. <laughs> a new soul arrives. Oh, we had a baby. Oh, the big Lee, you and my uh you and my slime had a we're we're sitting in a tree apparently. <laughs> Uh, Velpepper, since you're not here very, uh, often, would you like to have a little slime race for the chance to win a prize for your little one? I think that could be pretty fun. I'm gonna go ahead and hold one anyway, because I could use a break from the, like, um, two little bits of work that I've done the entire stream, because I work very slowly. <laughs> Yeah, we're texturing a model for uh, Benicula, her little character Shmoo. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, for Spooky Month, we reskin the uh, uh, Slime Race Island. Yeah, it's gonna look all autumnal for uh, for 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 Saint Hollow's Month. There's your little egg yolk slime. V very satisfying shade of yellow. Super El Sacco's little similarly uh, satisfyingly shaded green one uh, won a race earlier. And Beliza, always a pleasure. <laughs> Look at Slime Lee's little, little tall slime there. Very cute. Alright, I'll do a 10 second countdown. For anybody else that might be lurking to join if they would like to. Oh, hi, Ekaflassi. Good to see you're still here. There's a little one, Nickelodeon. All right, we will start in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. <laughs> Let's start, though. Oh, yeah, the pot lid. <laughs> yeah, I, I like the pot lid shield. I just, I just kind of I got that idea from Breath of the Wild. <laughs> All right, we are off to the races. We've got Vel Pepper. We've got we've got Rocky. We've got Slime Lee. We've got Nickelodeon. We've got Beliza. All seasoned champions of the racetrack. Vel Pepper's little one taking an early lead, but getting a little bit sleepy at the top of Bunny Hill. Allowing Rocky and Slime Lee to almost close the distance. Rocky and Bell Pepper neck and neck as we get to the bottom of Bunny Hill. It is still very early on. It is very much anyone's race. Rocky pulling ahead. What did I tell you? That's the kind of high octane table flip action we've got on Slime Race Island. Why would you ever play any other video game? <laughs> when you've got slime races. It's kind of funny that uh, this this environment and Fortnite both run in the same engine. So it is, it is the same technology behind both of these. I just find it kind of funny. Two very different levels of ambition for video games. <laughs> Alright, Rocky is maintaining a narrow lead as we move on to the final stretch of Slime Race Island. 
the treacherous geyser valley, these little geothermal vents can shove these little beans back and mix things up in the last third of the race. Who will? <laughs> Better than Fortnite? Well, maybe. Uh, yeah, who will Arter and Jesus bless her curse as he flies in on his six-legged horse and um, throws us in his magic sack and um, grants three wishes to... I don't know, I, I've lost track of this bit. Oh! I don't know who won that! It was either Nickelodeon or Slime Lee. That was kind of a photo finish. And graphically, the finish line is a little amorphous, so we'll we'll see at the results screen who got first place. Very exciting. All right, Beliza, about to come in third place. Yes, Beliza will be winning a song. Rocky and Vel Pepper. Unfortunately, you will not be getting prizes, but very solid performance. That was a very close uh close race. All right, let's go to the race results island and see who won and who won what. Look at all these colorful little things. All right, it was Nickelodeon. Congratulations to Ekaflasty and your little one. You'll be getting a gold feather in your cap for winning the race. Belize will be winning a song. A little Kirby song. Slimy will win a little Zelda song. Yes, your boy. <laughs> oh, you learned a little wind spell. Very nice. Oh, I, I can't wait until somebody wins the level three wind spell. It is very cool. Yes, Kakariko Village, absolutely. Yeah, I was able to find a um, program that strips the uh, separate audio channels out of Super Nintendo songs, so I was able to um, isolate the uh, flute from that. Um, yeah, FYI, um, A Link to the Past's music is a big pain in the ass to isolate instruments from because it likes to split um, the same instrument over, like, eight different channels for different, like, the root note and the high notes and such. Um, also, uh, uh, that soundtrack has a bunch of string instruments in it, and so it was hard to find songs that weren't mostly strings, because we don't have a stringed instrument that the slimes can play. I probably should have given them one, but, you know, you live and learn. As Shadow the Hedgehog, uh, taught us, you live and learn. I think we could all learn a little something from Shadow the Hedgehog. Oh, I've been Ronnie'd. Ahoy ye tarnished. <laughs> I really like that um that emote. It looks like the um Super Metroid uh title screen. Right. Like this song. I like I like me some Curtis Mayfield. Oh, tiny hat. I got a tiny Ronnie hat. Look at how much it look at how much it jangles. Ugh, I'm getting dizzy. A new soul arrives. You drawing little Sonics on my... Oh, uh, Mixie, looks like you're my slime. We're also sitting in a tree. Goop is, is getting around, it seems. Yeah, it's weird how the Super Nintendo's uh, sound chip worked. A apparently, like, everything... It didn't really have any built-in sounds. It was, like, all samples. That's why they've been able to do those, like, um, re mastered like um osts uh where they like actually track down the, the samples um like the cds that they got the samples from oh noodle cat welcome streamers welcome streamer to the raid wait oh i messed up the song we really appreciate all being here we really appreciate you raiding the stream because we like having more people 
here. Good God, that was awful. Hello, readers. Hello, Noodle Cat. Very good to see you. How did your stream go? I, I was tuning into that earlier. Um, uh, what, 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 what were you working on? Um, Friendship. Yeah, popcorn. That's what you were doing. Friendship. Absolutely. Noodle Cat does things. I'm going to shout her out. Shout out. Noodle Cat does things. Yeah, Noodle Cat is a big time friend of the show. Um, they are another uh, Unreal Engine based VTuber doing some really cool interactive stuff and um, add them some new fun redeems to their to their their avatar. <laughs> I pose, yes. Noodle Cat famously um, I poses a lot. I pose for dominance, absolutely. Oh yeah, Flowerson, you should definitely um you should definitely check out Noodle Cat's streams whenever you get a chance. It, yeah, Noodle Cat is um uh is a very fun avatar, very fun redeems, and a very pleasant person to hang out with. <laughs> Arms are for weaklings, absolutely. We don't we don't need do you, we don't need I call them crutches. A lot of people call them arms, but I just call them, you know. Oh, thank you for watering Mandy. <laughs> How long have I been streaming for? Uh, let's see. Because my stream got split up because we done crashed earlier. Let me see how long I was streaming before. I was streaming before. I was streaming before. Let's see here. Let's see, recent broadcast. Okay, so I was streaming for an hour and 38 minutes. Okay, so we'll stream for a little bit longer. It wasn't five hours, Captain Steel Pants. Captain Steel Pants trying to... Oh, thank you, Flowerson. Yep. That, that... See, Flowerson is truthful. I don't know why you have to, how, why you have to lie so much. And steel pants. <laughs> what are you trying to hide, Captain Steel Pants, behind your lies, huh? I don't know where I was going with that bit. Oh, here we go. Okay, let's. Here we go. Batman. <laughs> what about Batman the Big Lee? <laughs> hey, it's me, Pumpkin Potion. Um, gotta love me. <laughs> I'm the baby. Yeah, I haven't done that bit in a while. I gotta just have some, like, flashcards of dumb... <laughs> Flower said, I think Boom is, is was saying that in jest. Boom does like to... Boom's such a kidder. <laughs> I tried. I think that was a pretty good, um... Baby from Dinosaurs impression. I... I want to hear you, the Big Lee, I want to hear you, I, I need you to make a TikTok, I need you to record yourself uh, impersonating the baby from dinosaurs, and we'll, we'll have a, a baby from dinosaurs death match. We're, we're going to have an internet feud about who's dinosaurs baby, baby Sinclair, that's the name of that, that little monster, yeah, be there, or be... Sinclair. <laughs> I'd like to see that. I would like to see that, actually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if nobody knows what I'm talking about, oh my god. Consider yourself lucky. Um, baby Sinclair. 
Yeah, this little fucking monstrosity. Look at his... Ugh, he's even... Look at this little... Vision. I'm making a call-out post to the big Lee. I don't know. I gotta... I'd... Oh my god, I, I got I gotta record a promo and like actually write a script and then we'll do I'll do a little call out post on my Twitter.com. <laughs> yeah, it's a mama. Tiny hat. Technical parameters. What is it? This is not the one I wanted. Uh, stitches. This is the one I wanted. There we go. Oh, you're increasing the size of your slime. Was Baby Sinclair a she? I always thought Baby Sinclair was a boy. Let me see. I had a toy of Baby Sinclair. Um, youngest member. Yeah, let's go to Muppet Wiki. Um, his catchphrase. Okay, so apparently Baby Sinclair is a boy. Allegedly. Oh, here we go. We got a bunch of options here. Oh, thank you for the head pats. Oh, I see what you did, Captain Steel Pants. I said, say something nice to me, and you said that literally something nice to me. Captain Steel Pants never has anything nice to say to me. He's always just T pose and goth mode and, and pumping potion mode. Just, I don't know why Captain Steel Pants so mean to me. I'm just a little streamer here trying to put on an internet puppet show. What am I doing? <laughs> Boy, the Kefka song's organ matched up pretty well with this song's pretty terrible organ solo. I'm going to skip the rest of the song. Let's see here. I need something a little less sleepy. No. Eh, Space Cowboy, why not? See you, Space Cowboy. Oh, thank you. Big Lee's a big sweetheart. <laughs> I, I, I am gonna record that feud video and, and call you out, though. Um, it, it will be in jest. Because uh, I'm very fond of you, the big leap, but I think a baby Sinclair mm -hmm. challenge is is funny. Wow. I don't know why he's so, I don't know why Captain Steel Pants is so mean. Let's see. I'm going to type that in my stream notes. Baby Sinclair call out. <laughs> Can I get these to be vertical? Can I rotate these? Puncture intensity. Channel mapping. Hmm, attributes. Yeah, I would like these to be vertical. 
Is there an option for that? Ooh, I gotta be careful, these sliders, they really, they really slow things down. Oh yeah, Big Lee's stream indeed. Yeah, Big Lee has a, um, is a, is a fellow VTuber. I'm gonna go ahead and shout him out. Um. The Big Lee. Yeah, the Big Lee is a streamer, um, a fellow VTuber. Um, he does uh, streams of uh, uh, like marbles on stream, that that multiplayer game, um, and does like phasma, uh, phasma, phasmagoria. Is that what it's called? I keep forgetting the name of it, but it's a spooky ghost detecting game. He plays that, um, and yeah, he's he's a, he's a very sweet dude, a uh, very fun person to hang out with on a stream. As I, I if the big lee's on i suggest you get get you get your butt in there and you and you you watch and you watch it and you type in it and you redeem things in it and you enjoy the big lee's company like i do phasmophobia that's what it is oh yeah you've got the um the one with the stovepipe has is that the one you're talking about I don't think I've seen um, one of your streams since you premiered that one. I, w I will definitely do that, the Big Lee. As soon as you send me that Baby Sinclair submission. Be there, be Sinclair. I got, I got to write the script for that. I feel like that those two words rhyming uh, is uh, has a. I could get a lot of mileage out of that, so I got to sit down and actually write a script. <laughs> I think I might uh, be watching the FNAF movie with somebody apparently after the stream. Uh, let me check my messages, actually, because Cappy um, was asking how long I was going to stream for. I just want to make sure that I didn't miss them. Hang on a sec. We'll go to the slime cam while I do that. I'm just going to send them a message. Okay, I just sent them a message. Oh, we haven't started yet? Um, yeah, I think I'll, uh, I think I'll actually wrap things up. We'll have, like, one more slime race, and, uh, just to cap off the evening, and then, uh, I'm going to go ahead and hang out with Cappy and, uh, 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 another friend, a fellow friend that we have. Oh, nine big fruit. Oh, you only need one more, one more boom. What time is it for all of you? It is about 7 p.m. for me. I don't know, what, uh, I don't know if you've mentioned what time zone you're in. Yeah, definitely, uh, nobody docks themselves if, if they don't have to, but yeah. 8 p.m. there? Okay, so you're in a similar part of the world to me. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and hold this, because I've been um, just kind of progressing very slowly on this model. I think I need to do a little bit of research on how to get it to look the way that I want, because um, I've kind of just been, like, zooming in and out and not getting anything done, so. Yeah, so we'll go ahead and hold the slime race. The Jamiroquai song just ended, so that's a good place to do it at. All right, let's have the last slime race of the evening. All right, if you would like your little one to participate in the 
final slime race of the evening. Go ahead and type exclamation point play into that there chat box to zoom to this here island. We've got Belize on the field, we've got Sir Pants on the field. We've got Rocky on the field. Does anyone else have the beans to challenge these three little ones? Does anyone have the vacuoles? Does anyone have big enough nucleus to challenge these four beans? Oh! <laughs> Slime Lee and Feisty coming in hot. Alright, I'll do a 10 count in case anybody is lurking. Go ahead and start in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Alright, Starto. Alright, we are off to the races, the final race for the evening. Oh, Cappy, you're too late to mess up my county. <laughs> Better luck next time. Um, let's see, yo. Oh yeah, another thing I was gonna mention is that I am thinking of making another race course for the slime race. I was thinking of doing like a, um, like, ocean kind of wind wakery, emerald coast kind of island hopping, um, uh, racetrack. Because I figured, like, islands in the middle of an infinite ocean would be a pretty easy thing for me to model. And yeah, people have uh, requested more um, racetracks. I think that would be uh, kind of an easy way for me to provide a little bit of uh, visual variety. So yeah, that will that will be something that I will be looking into in the near future. All right, Beliza, Flowerson's little one, has taken an early lead as we go across Waterfall Bridge, the treacherous suspension bridge with very sharp edges. These little ones will have to make a dexterity saving throw to make sure they don't puncture their cytoplasm and spill whatever slimes are filled with. There are lots of things that um, ugh. I'm abandoning that bit. I'm tired, you guys. They do hover pretty good over the bridge, the Big Lee. Thank you for pointing out that the collision is, um... <laughs> ...does not match the terrain. I might have to have that hug the ground a little bit closer. <laughs> Alright, Beliza is passed over. Her geyser. Clear path to victory. It's gonna have to take quite a miracle for Feisty to catch up. Oh, Belize is falling asleep. Do you believe in miracles? Perhaps. Oh. I'm very close, but no cigar. Spicy Mecha Breeder finishing in second. Congratulations to Flower Sen and her little one, Beliza. Congratulations to Feisty and subscribe to Fruitsy Collins. Hashtag not spawns. I had nothing to do with the naming of that slime. God, that's a long username. <laughs> Slimely getting stunlocked a little bit on their geyser, but no slime left behind. I believe in you, Slimely. I don't care what, what anyone else says, I, I believe in this tall boy. Slimely is racing for two. Or two and two thirds, I guess. <laughs> oh, the big Lee. Slime <laughs> leaping to the sleepy bean. Oh, that's a, that's very sweet, slime. Wait, oh my, the big Lee. I'm ta I, I was I was talking to your slime for a second. All right, I'm getting streamer brain up the wazoo. So let's uh let's find out what y'all want. Alright, congratulations to Flowerson and Beliza for winning the last race of the evening. We'll be getting a little 
Gold Feather. Subscribe to Fruitsy, Superscribe to Fruitsy Collins, excuse me. Want a little song? Icy, want a little Final Fantasy VI song? Oh, and Belize learned a little light spell. Very nice. Are you going to try multi-streaming soon? I'm not sure what multi-streaming is. Uh, what is that exactly? We're going to go to the slime cam while I find somebody to raid. So we're going to wrap up the stream. I'm going to find a cool friend to send you all to. Let's see. Who's doing what? I like the near series. Replicant was very cool. I okay, we're going to raid a brand new person. Someone who I am fond of. I don't know how to read their username, but I have watched their streams. I should probably ask them how to say their names. Oh yeah, see see you, Captain uh Captain Steelpants. Let me do my little outro. Oh, Flowerson. Uh what's up? Do you need uh do you need a to... uh let's see. As an affiliate, Twitch doesn't allow stream in multiple places at once. Yeah, I think that that's true, yeah. Yeah, you have a good one too, Velpepper. If you stick around for the raid, you will get um, some extra channel points. Let's see. Can you raid my best friend? Um, I need to check people out before uh, before I raid uh, Flowerson. If you uh, message me uh, with their username, I can check out their channel and just kind of I, I like to vet things before I send people off to them just as like a precaution. So, you know, just got to be careful. Uh, Neon Cat 23. I will copy and paste that and check them out uh, after the stream. And yeah, maybe we'll give them a raid later if I. Uh, I'm sure they're fine. I just I just need to be careful. Uh, let's see. Check out raid. Okay, made a note of that. So, oh my god, my computer is chugging. Okay, so we are going to raid this fellow here. He is a VTuber that has this really cool, like, uh, low-poly kind of uh, pixely style that I really enjoy. It looks like he's doing some programming for his uh, environment. I was watching a little bit of that earlier. Um, and yeah, I haven't gotten to raid him before, so we're going to go ahead and do that. Yeah, I will set up the raid. Uh, and before we go, um, I would just like to thank you all so much for tuning in. Let me get my left hand up in the air. There you go. I would like to thank you all for tuning in. Uh, this was a really fun stream. Um, thank you for being patient with me doing art very slowly. We got raided by three people, I think, tonight. Yeah, Noodle Cat, Saria, um, oh god, and one other person I'm forgetting. But I'll go ahead and give them all shoutouts on the, on the, on the Twitters and such. Um, but yeah, so I didn't get as much done as I usually do because, uh, I'm still a new streamer and get a little overwhelmed with how much activity there was, uh, at the time. Uh, but yeah, uh, I just really appreciate all of you. Um, I love that the um, community is growing. I'm meeting a lot of really great people. Um, and I had a, a bunch of fun tonight, and I hope you did too. So I'm going to set up the raid. <laughs> Sorry.